up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here with Marty Music. We're going to learn Friend of the Devil by the Grateful Dead. I'd done a version of this uh, many years ago that was just off of a really weird version. So I want to redo it. We're going to do it right now. Uh, also, thanks for supporting what I do here in Marty Music. If you haven't yet, I appreciate you subscribing, hitting that bell notification, and then also I've got great uh, resources, guitar lesson resources, in the links below. So check those out and uh, let's learn this tune. Here we go. All right, I got some pretty cool folky bluegrassy kind of techniques here to show you. But if you were just a beginner, you could still play this song, you know, like campfire style. You got a G chord and you got a C chord or even a C add nine um, and then a D and an A minor chord. So the basic core of the song, G, C, G, C, and then up to D, A minor, D, then A minor twice as long, and now D twice as long, or even longer. And then it starts over, so that's the main part of the song. We're gonna get deeper. One more time. D, A minor. D, A minor twice as long, and D. So what you can add with that basic thing is this underlying descending part. finger on the fifth fret of the D, we're going down the G major scale. Five with the ring, four with the middle, slide that down to the second, then play it open, then ring finger to the third fret, you're going to play a C chord, then second fret, then open A, and then a G chord. So with that, ring, middle, holes up, down, open, ring, middle, open, ring, finger. We're going to add this little open cluster that comes from a G major chord. Middle finger, same thing. That slides down and we're going to grab pinky, that same thing, but now with our pinky. Open, we're still grabbing this part. So. C major chord, hit that bass note on the A string. Second fret. So I'm hitting that open and I'm forming an A minor chord. It's going by really fast. Like that, so. Although there's slow versions too. Then on the D chord, you can add a bass line, which would be for D, it would be D, A, D, A, and then the A minor, A, E, A, E, D, A, D, A, 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 D. So, um. have to do 
do that, but it's a nice little addition. to C, 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 and whatever voicings, you know, they're, they're doing lots of stuff there, but at the basics is C, 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 D, 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 then A minor, C, D, Those are all the parts. I mean, the, the of the form. There's a uh, there's some cool little bluegrass licks on the right side of, of the mix. Um, but so we've got the basic form. Now there's versions that play it slower. There's acoustic versions. You know, you can hear lots of different ways to play it. But I think underneath is still this uh, form and pretty much in this key. Um, you know, G is a classic bluegrass key. And this is very much Americana bluegrass style. You know, not straight bluegrass, but definitely that folky bluegrass-inspired Americana, American beauty. Um, okay, so, like, I know there's a classic uh, dead version where, you know, they do a little chromatic thing on that bridge, like... <laughs> Know, just little things like that, but it's nonetheless, it's still the same. All right, there's a lot of impro improvisation going on, but uh, the two first cool little bluegrassy lines. And it's faster than that on the recording, but we're going to start with... Just sliding uh, four to five on the D, then with that open G. See that? Then we're gonna pull off the fourth fret on that G. Dun, 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 dun. So I'm going. Four, five on it's the G major scale, and it's four, five on the G. And then I'm going up to that third fret B. So. And then da, B, three, five, then three slid back to one. And then da, da. So then we go open D hammer to two, then roll over with a second fret pull off on the G, and then back to second fret there to open G. So real slow. And then there's a variation. So just five, three, one, one to pull off, open G. So with the pretty slow version. Uh,
hope you guys enjoyed the lesson. Thank you again for the continued support. Uh, if you haven't yet, I appreciate you subscribing here to the channel, clicking the bell notification, and then also, once again, great resources in the links below, like the first comment, for instance. Check it out. Thanks again, you guys. Hope to see you later.